Sup. Sup, 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 sup. How's everybody doing? How are y'all doing? Uh, let me... Sup, Lord Vader? YouTube, YouTube gets priority because um, I forget about them all the time. Hello. Sup, Old Rod? Panda. Frumius. Cyber Dragon. Rosin. Lupo. How's everybody doing today? If I sound tired, that's only because I'm tired. <laughs> that's- that's- that's it. I'm tired. Um, yeah. Uh... Uh... Yeah. So, how is everybody doing today? <laughs> to Blin. Did it- did it saving me from my final day at work? What- what- what's saving you? What's up, Bailey Raker? We are drinking black tea today because we want that extended release of um, caffeine. Like, we don't want this. Melman, oh my god, thanks so much for summoning. It's only been three months, Tom. It's only been three months. Damn, it feels like longer. <laughs> so we, we want that, like, we want, like, we want to be like this. You know, like that. That's- this- this is how I- oh, you guys can't see it. You can't see it. Yeah, sorry. Um... <laughs> we don't want to be like this. This is coffee. We want- we want to be- we want to be like this, okay? Th so- so that's why I'm drinking black tea. You can't focus on stream because of Final Fantasy VII? Did it, like, just come out or something? been playing an amazing pixel art game reminded me of the stream what, what game is it what's up imagine lee i'm doing pretty good lord vader just a little tired i have a lot on my plate i have a lot of tasks in the queue i somehow turned off my 6 30 alarm without being aware that i woke up at seven but i think i feel more tired than i would have it, it isn't it like you have like your rem cycles and it doesn't necessarily matter how many hours you get of sleep but where in the REM cycle you wake up um I woke up to my dog jumping on the bed and saying <laughs> that's that's kind of what my dog did black tea is better than coffee coffee gives you more of a kick black tea is kind of like yo we gonna chill bro you gonna feel awake you just need to let it hit you know that's, that's kind of like the dis difference no game dev on my stream lately. It took three months for me to add the ooh song. <laughs> my bad, Tom. I'm sorry. I didn't even need to ban coffee. For you. No one said I stopped drinking coffee, okay? I just, I'm drinking tea right now. This is a. Uh... What? I think I missed a message. Oh, yeah, so solar. The, the jet lag today. It's feeling better for sure. Um, but it's still there. <laughs> how many? Okay, let me see. How how long does jet lag last? On average, it takes people about one day to just for one to one and a half hour time change. I did 11. So is it going to take me 11 days? <laughs> What's up, Snow? Core Keeper. Roger, Spring thank time. you so much. Or shall I say spider time? <laughs> Amused. Roger, I asked you on... I don't know if you answered the question on Discord. You said that a spider came out of a shell. Was it a white shell? Battling sand, sad boy hours today? Well, is everything good? Why you have them sad boy hours. What's up, Robotech? Yeah, I think, guys, my jet lag is gonna last about, like, a week or something. If you get lots of sunlight. God damn it. Should I, like, stop streaming right now? <laughs> no, I think tomorrow I'm gonna get more sunlight because, uh... <sighs> gotta no, renovate. God! No, God, please, no! No! 
big to, no! no one no one no! allowed you in here okay so you could just leave okay and how are you gonna improve the uwu experience because i don't think those two things go together how are you doing robotech i saw that i posted on bug channel don't know what a white shell is regarding spiders what's up redmer bug club the shell or the spider oh No, okay, yeah, that's not the white shell. Uh, yeah, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> you said we were gonna stop stream. Okay, Beaks, it's acceptable. <laughs> Coffee is like a shot from a syringe. Tea is like an IV drip. <laughs> 20 milligram per 100 grams of tea. Fun fact, tea leaves have more caffeine in them than coffee. Okay, interesting. Face hugger egg. No spider streams today. I know there's a lot of arachnophobics. Okay. Alrighty, guys. So, uh, I did manage to get some of the animations in. Like, eating grass. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, every time I say eating grass, I laugh. <laughs> if you know why I laugh at that, then you're just as bad. <laughs> <laughs> listen i didn't name this animation snow did okay so we can all dive into her subconscious <laughs> snow like you want to help with the project and you leave your subconscious out of it <laughs> hey yo we have eating grass yeah look at this <laughs> Eating grass. I just want the boars to feel alive. We told you to touch grass, not eat it. You can check the current experience in the DGen channel. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> god dang it. I'm afraid to go through this channel and stream. Okay, let's see it. Is it this? Slots, primer, Justin does not have enough currency. Straight to gambling. No, I don't think it's that. Oh, this is the current experience. Okay, sorry. So, here we fling go. <laughs> oh my god, Tom, Jesus Christ, how dare you? How dare you, Tom? How dare you? <laughs> that roar that roar though oh my god <laughs> oh my god okay <laughs> robot's like you don't want to know <laughs> jesus christ <laughs> i kind of want to have like a shower of uwus it would have to be a gif raining there's like actually some pixel software i downloaded oh this pixel composer demo let me check this out <laughs> robotech i wonder if i can make it in here wait what the heck i've never used this has anyone ever used this before Maybe I should learn it off stream. 3D color values. Image.
Yeah, I, I think I, I need to like actually learn how to use this. It, it, it kind of looks. Oh wait, is this like? Yeah, this is kind of strange. Let me see a, a demo. I, I do want to learn how to use it though. Can, can you not? It went into another screen. Why? Why is it? One second. Uh, I just have the demo. It's called Pixel Composer. Every time I, I like expand it, it goes to the second monitor. I don't know why it's doing that. What the? Sorry, guys. I'm really slow. Okay, let me just close out. Let me open Steam. Okay, I think it'll work now. God damn it. Okay. Yeah, it's really cool. Wow. Whoa, it makes it 3D. Holy crap. Press window key, shift arrow key. Okay, I'll try it when it's full screened. Oh, okay, work, thanks. What's up, Njenko? Okay, actually, I think particle. Wait, let me look at the. What's up, Mark? I got myself a new phone. It's cool. What phone did you get? The DJ channel is very cursed. Yes, you're right. Um, Subdottle. This is neat, but I feel like doing this an engine would work too. That is true. New phone who dis. <laughs> Sub Salaroff. Pretty interesting app. Yeah. I, I just. What I would like, uh, let's let's put the Lemmings game. I would like if a streamer bot could somehow communicate with the Godot apps, so that if like uh, someone redeems something, it can like go to the whole to the game, which is just like an overlay on the stream. I'm sure it's possible. I just need to figure out how. Have my streamer bot to talk to my unit. And how does it... What does streamer bot do? It, it does like what? An HTTP request? One second, guys. Been like getting Kelly's. to grips with Godot. Your tile map video helped. Thanks. Wow. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. I'm, I am expanding on that. Um, but yeah, I, I appreciate that. Thanks so much. Uh, I'm trying to see. This one, I can't find the window. Someone abish. Someone abish. Twitch games debug. Okay, here it is. Sorry, guys. Extra slow today. My bad. Cool. Cool. Music. What's up? Bye, Kunta. I use files. When someone redeems something, it creates a file with the info. The app listens to change its fold to, to changes in the folder. Interesting. 
Interesting. I think we could also use like Python. I think Python also could be some type of interesting connection. Yeah, Pirate Software definitely uses Streamer Bot. I've spread tools, hammers, brooms, whatever around the house. Okay, let's look at some of Streamer Bot's. Uh, okay, let's say the Uwu song. It plays, it does this sub action. Their core. There's network. C sharp. Execute C sharp code. Oh. Execute C sharp code. See, I think if we use Godot with C sharp, that would be easier. Set argument actions. Run action. Commands. File IO. Read lines from a file. Write to a file. So that's something that Tom's doing. And I'm sure in Godot, there's ways to see like if a file has changed. Miscellaneous. Logic. If else. Sounds. Play sounds. Keyboard. Run a program. Run a program. Toast notification. Keyboard press. Timers. Set timer state. Users. Voice control. Okay. See, that's the core stuff. There's integrations as well. There's Discord integrations. Yeah. Network. Fetch URL. Did I get some sleep? I think I went to bed like at 12 and I woke up at 9. Which is really late for me. I do not like waking up at 9. What do you want to do? Uh, I want StreamerBot to run a function in Godot. Um... I don't use StreamerBot, but just do it 100% Godot. It's much simpler. But, uh, Menjenko, it's about connecting Godot with the bits. <sighs> See, that already sounds too complicated. I think just writing to a file would be, like, the easiest thing to do. And then having Godot, like, check... Yeah, donations as well. Um, having Godot check the state of a file. Godot. Godot. Okay. Alrighty, guys. Let's program. Um. So, I need to add... Yeah. I don't want to mess with servers and requests and... I'm good. I'm good on that. Sounds fun, but I'm good. <laughs> Eat grass. For now, since we don't have like a baby animation, the eat grass state will just go straight to idle. It the the boar only eats grass in the wander state. So, in the wander state, it starts off eating grass, and then at the end of the animation, it... Oh no, I think it's actually in the idle state. To idle. Bam. Yeah, we're good. I could see Jackie setting up a bot that does DDoS attacks. Mm, nah. I've been having issues with tile set physics lately. My player object will get stuck on the corner of connected tiles when it should walk over. Um, Mark, I think I've had that issue. Is your player like a square? Because normally when such issues happen, you should use a capsule. 
I usually use this shape. For your character. What is this called? What is that called in 2D? I don't know. Okay. One second, guys. I'm just... Before stream, a capsule. Yeah. He's not cool. have a confession to make i've been watching a lot of those chiropractor videos where they go <coughs> i'm in that phase right now <laughs> but I, I i'm also kind of scared i'm not sure if i would go to a chiropractor because i saw that news report where that girl was like paralyzed and i know that's like very rare for that to happen but that just freaks me out D has anyone here ever been to a chiropractor? <laughs> oh, you guys? Wow, so many people have been to chiropractors? It's crazy. Those aren't real doctors. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wow, I'm, I'm really surprised that many people have gone to it. Okay. No problem, Mark. Okay. <laughs> Shade 11. Shade 11, can you do exclamation mark join? Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't do it, honestly. Yeah, you're into the degen prison, Shade 11. You need to stay there. <laughs> I can't <laughs> God damn. Celiac disease? But isn't that a disease in the blood? How would they know? Oh, that's another one in the bucket. You hear that? <sighs> Dat princess. Mm, mm. This is Minecraft calling you. Um, I'm not really. I didn't imprison you. Uh, I don't know what happened. Did I spell your name wrong? Shade 11. What the hell? You're gone. <gasps> okay. Wait. You're in. You're in. Too late. Too late. You're imprisoned forever. Ha! Ah, you're still in there. Ha ha ha! Why is Snow not in prison? That's a good question. That is a good question. God damn it. Okay, enough imprisoning people. We need to get to work. Okay, I am Jackie Codes, okay? <laughs> I know, I need a bigger... We need to put them in different locations. You can't escape the long arm. <laughs> Wardens are always super teachers. Um, I'm not really so much tempted to play Minecraft right now, okay? We could also, uh, there could be like three positions in the prison. And it should check if it's like, because in Godot you'll just add them as a child. 
And if the first position is taken, go to the second. La -di -da -di -da -da -ba -da -da -ba -da. Just got a tooth pulled. Now I need to hear nice things like an ooh woo. No, you don't. You're good. Oh, Frumius asked me a question. Have you seen Google Sima? Are you trying to like lead something on? Sima balls, huh? <laughs> I don't trust you, Frumius. <laughs> I've been streaming for way too long, okay? Way too long. You wouldn't understand. <laughs> okay. Obviously, this is broken. It's broken in a very broken way. <laughs> I will never forget when I first was hit with one of those. It was a suck on these. Yeah. It's, it's, it's difficult. Yeah, I know. Rosin, just, can you not? Okay, guys, there's a problem. Actually. Actually. Okay. Character. Main character. Wait, let me make sure I commit. That was a really bad commit statement. No, just don't do it, Taraka, okay? Alright, um, so... New inherited scene. I think before I do a new inherited, I need to do that. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Okay, cool. Here, 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 here. Copy properties here. Um, they kind of disappeared. Okay, that's good. Shit. So stagger up works. But the rest don't. Hell yeah, why don't you post the link? So yeah, in the MRI report, they said you definitely have a herniation. <laughs> but honestly, I'm pretty hopeful about it. I'm gonna go to like a physical therapist and that's why I've been watching this chiropractor videos. I just want to have like a lot of mobility. And uh, yeah, I think it was like around, it's like in my C4, C5, and I think like C6, there's some like herniation there. So I was right. <laughs> I felt that. Yeah, I don't know exactly. I think it was... I'm pretty sure it's like... For sure C4 to C5, but yeah. Uh, so your your spine has like... Let me just get a picture of it. I ain't gonna draw that.
Yeah. So this is like your spine. And uh, these are your discs. It's like a jelly-like structure. And herniation is like, I guess when some of that fluid or stuff like kind of comes out a little bit. And yeah, it just, cause this is supposed to be super flexible. You know, that's why they're not like made out of bones. And when that happens, it like, it could be a little hurdy push it back in so yeah when i like first damaged it <laughs> when i first damaged it like i well first of all it's like from sitting at the computer all day programming um yeah i, I like couldn't even look up and down that that's kind of what happens a little hurdy <laughs> um but it lasted like, you know, like three days. And my mom, honestly, it's also a lot of genetics because my mom's back is similar. Um, but yeah, sitting at the computer. That's why, like, look, I'm just going to stand up. <laughs> you need to stand up more. You also need to like stretch your neck more, like do stuff like that. So it's like now it's kind of getting better. You know, like, I can do all the, the movements, but I just need to be cautious. I need to go to a physical therapist, you know, do stuff like that. But my back is pretty good. It's mostly my neck that's acting up. Does it go away on its own? I'm not really sure. I think you could make it get a lot better. Um, but, you know, if you keep on in the same hab habits, it can get, like, worse and worse. That's why, like, I've been watching these chiropractor videos because there's some people, they have, like, super messed up neck where they, like, they haven't been able to look from side to side for, like, 10 years, you know? Of course, that's, like, an extreme case, but at the end of the day, like, the dude is just trying to give them more mobility. So it kind of makes me see that, like, I just need to do, like, mobility exercises as often as possible. Caused by your brain being just too damn big for your spine to hold. That's a nice way of seeing it. <laughs> mm. That's interesting. Oh yeah, using the GPU particles, that's true. That is true. Where did you link it? No, I, I, I'm too scared to go to a chiropractor. I don't know where you linked it for me. All right. Shit. Okay, wait. Mm. Hold on. I said, have you seen Google Seema? And he said, no. What is this? Seema balls. He's so upset. He's so upset live on the stream. <laughs> that son of a bitch. He's like a dad that's lost all of his patience. <laughs> What's up, the animator guy? Um, what am I doing right now? Uh, chat is basically distracting me a lot. I, I want to work on these animations. Uh, I just, I keep getting distracted. <laughs> So I'm, I have a bunch of these animations and I have a very bad workflow. 
when I add a new animation. That ain't gonna cut it. Now I'm looking at my commit history. Like, this one's okay. Reorder commit. How do I reorder? Damn, I can reorder that? That's cool. Okay, undo commit. That's cool. I've never done that before. Okay, I'm gonna stash the changes. Let's make sure our board didn't break. No, it's still eating grass. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, cool. The animations are working. Let me just play the game and see. I attempted to make a mini game of dome. Dude, Snow, like, what are you on right now? You made, like, we just got back from GDC. You made a horror game. You made a mobile game. You made a good, like, what? Wh wh what are you on? Please. <laughs> Jesus Christ. A bad workflow is better than no work. That is true, the animator guy. Thank you. Bro, something happened. I don't know. I've made three games in two days. Okay, can you make a video? I made three games in two days, please. Can you? Can you make that video? Okay. Can Can you make two more games? Can you make two more games and say I made five games in <laughs> Stop editing, Snow. Stop editing. Make two more games. <laughs> I made five games in one week. Come on. How many times have you seen a video like that, okay? <laughs> Snow. Okay, two more games. <laughs> oh my god. Barney perfect week, but encoding seven days, seven games. Snow, what are you using to edit? Seven more? <laughs> Grass allergies. Please share. Okay, it seems like everything's fine. And thank you for whoever said that my game looks nice. You're really nice. Look, you can... You can do that. You can do this. I can't hold down chop. You could do that. You can craft. You could craft a crafting table. You can put it down. Yeah, alchemy table. You can make alchemical things just give it some glass you know this game looks so shit you're <laughs> okay i guess it doesn't look that good you can talk to him you can pick berries you can um Go into a deep, dark, procedurally generated caves. I work in retail and this ain't it. <laughs> it's funny how you can tell someone's age by their message. <laughs> okay. You can, uh, you can, the, 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 the spiders will spawn. Can pick them nuts. <laughs> okay, okay, we're getting overflown. You can. What you talking about, Willis? You could walk in the water and go skinny dipping. <laughs> oh, okay, it's okay, guys. And yeah, we're working. I'm working so that the boars can eat grass. 
I want them to eat grass, but they're locked on me now. Okay. You, you see it eating grass? You see it eating grass? Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. It's gonna eat grass. It's gonna wander. You see it eating grass? It's eating grass. Oh shit, it got stuck. It got stuck eating grass. <laughs> Stop eating grass! <laughs> Guys, you know what's funny? You can literally bleep. You can literally bleep that clip I just did. Stop eating grass. Just bleep the first, the gr part. And it'll sound like I'm telling the board to stop eating ass. Okay, let's just go back to work, all right? Let's just, no, I, I'm sorry. Okay, um, yeah, nothing. All right, uh, all right, so we, mm -hmm. <laughs> That's true, lawn mowing. Furry dating to introduce skinny dipping into the game. <laughs> But I do agree, it's not a game yet. It's just a bunch of features. Uh, nah, Dax, I'm good. Eat underscore grass. Did I name it differently? Eat underscore grass? <laughs> I'm sorry, D-Will. Snow. Listen, Snow. You need to stop. <laughs> there's wild boar and there's eat grass. Okay, we're not going to look at that anymore. We need to... Eating ass. <laughs> oh my God. Mobile game, horror game, and two hours of multiplayer game. What should, what should I do next? Just Can you guys stop it, please? God damn it. I was just trying. Okay. All right. What's up, Torquedo? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to walk in on that. <laughs> I think I should work on my main project, maybe. You need a snow. Well, first of all, if you're trying to do a video, like making five games in a week, then no. But if you're not going to make that video, then uh, you shouldn't. Yo, what up, Lucky? How's it going? I love your videos. Today, my son asked, can I have a bookmark? And I burst into tears. 11 years old, and he still doesn't know my name is Brian. Uh, and welcome to the Twitch side, animator guy. Okay, guys. All right. Can I please just... <sighs> Let me just open up this animation, make sure it's okay. It's this one. Oh, this one doesn't have the stagger. But I think... Okay, I think I know what's wrong now. Open a sprite. This one has stagger. Wait, what? Oh, sh... Oh, no. Here. Okay, I need a I need a redeem something. Uh first tiger. What's up, Snoois? Okay, uh go to our stashed restore. We're not going to restore that one. Or that one. Stagger. Oh, shoot. I 
I did it the wrong way. Wait, what? Oh, no, no, no. That's actually fine. And then we can discard. Thank God for Git. Okay, now close that. There should be stagger in here. There it is. Yo, thank you so much for subbing to crit, giving a sub to crit crit. Did I name the piggy? Not yet. What is hand, foot, and mouth? I kind of don't want to ask. Sorry to hear that. All right, all right, all right. Save as. It's, oh, damn. A mini chicken pox? Dang. Aw. I hope he feels better. Shade 11, get out. Just leave. I need to re-import this. Okay, so these animations are good. But I need to... Put this... Please work, please work, please work. Nope. Nope. How has the region changed? 63, 29, 13, 29. <sighs> the petabyte CDs I have not. Unfortunately, what I have to do next is kind of long and arduous, so I'll do that off stream. We're just not going to have stagger. So we will discard those changes. There we go. We have that there, but I'll discard this. It'll stay in A sprite, and then I'll save it. Yes. Okay, cool. Cool. So now our character is fine. I don't even know what I'm gonna do today, honestly. I didn't plan that far ahead. I was thinking about like getting the animations working. Uh it's hmm. the biggest problem. Is the flow of the game. Maybe, in order to fix the flow, we need to have a beginning. <laughs> so in the beginning of the game, you're going to start off at this portal. I need to erase this. Let's erase that. Because you come to this world through this portal. Floor tiles. Did 
Did I not do this on the floor tile? Oh, I did it in the wrong layer. Cool. Environment. Items. What layer is that book on? Is that even a tile? What's up, Crunchy? Uh, maybe it is here. Items. Should be on a tile. <laughs> you like Goblin Boss? Yeah, it's a good one. It was? Okay, let's start. There's water. Obviously not there. Sand, it's not there. Biome zero, it's not there. Biome one, not there. Two, three, floor tiles, floor terrain. Oh, okay, there it is, yeah. It was on wall terrain, okay. Wait, what? What the hell? Was that a glitch? Oh! Okay, temporary. All right. All right. Cool, we found it. Um, and yeah, these uh a lot of the tiles are actually scene tiles, like the grass. So, we need to do it on the environment layer. Just bam. Kind of a little slow cuz I have a huge tile map. You can do something like that. Okay, so. For debugging purposes, you should... I want to be able to start with nothing, but I want to make it easy to start where I currently am. With all the items I have. So we kind of need a way to check mark how we want to start. This is semi-procedurally generated. So it is procedurally generated, but then I went in and touched it up. Because I wanna I wanna feel the whole flow of the game. And actually, yeah, I want to release like a demo to Patreon. Alright, cool. So I wonder where I would put that. Where is the game flowing to? What? Are you asking like the map? This is the whole map. I played Memorial on stream yesterday. The game is evil. It took me 56 minutes. And I died 412 times. I'm sorry for making fun of you. <laughs> How long did it take me? I think I died like 76 times. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't I die 76 times? <laughs> Get wrecked. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, you see. You just need to get good, Tom. <laughs> there's no there's no other no other explanation. All right, so I started out printing labels on specialized burnable DVDs and then moved on to the master rig. And okay, money is settled. Okay, I don't know what that is, but okay, sounds good. 
Ricard. <laughs> the amount of times I needed to. Okay, I'm gonna sit down. Sims. Alright. So, let's... Let's put our architecture hats on. Alrighty, so... Um... The way my game is organized. <sighs> we have our game. It's on a node. It's not even a node 2D. And then we have our main menu. And when the game is running, we just add the world node to this tree. We need to look into this. Okay, we have states. And here's the menu scene. So when you press play selected world, my magical bean, I'm sorry, I don't have that. Yeah, Sims Sims was a nice era of video gaming. <laughs> I played Sims mostly on like the PlayStation 2 with my sister. Those are some good memories. <laughs> okay. So world select control. Load world. So we go to save stage sync, we retrieve all the worlds. Because uh, I wanted to centralize the nodes that I get data from, like from the files. That's why I have it structured like this. I don't want like anywhere to get data, substance in your pantalone. So here we're initializing the save file. Save file object, delete world, retrieve world data, load world data, get a mutable file at position. a world package variable we go to the file operation node and we get all the files so we're getting all the worlds probably gets all files from the world name folder okay no not all the world check if user world folder exists if user world array get directories at for I in we're getting all the files check if there's actually world data if not delete the folder world file path we're getting a world data txt actually we could probably see that Godot saves your file here Where's Lawcraft? Here it is. User world. This world data.txt. 
is encrypted. Not really. So yeah, you could see we're just... It could see the last time we updated that world. What version the world was created in. Yeah, I did the version number so that if you build something, your world wouldn't break. But I haven't been keeping up with that. Game mode story. Super encrypted. <laughs> I like to sometimes play Godot games and see if they encrypt it. I don't know if... Uh... <laughs> uh Torcado's here. Let's see if, if it's encrypted. No, okay. It's dot res. What is dot res? That's like a... Oh, that's a resource. Okay. Saving them as resources. Mods cho chose violence today. <laughs> yeah, but I, there, there's sometimes Godot games I'll play and it, it, it wasn't encrypted. And literally like... For an RPG, it's kind of bad because this one Godot game I was playing is so not encrypted. I could change the level of my strength. I could change my skill level, everything. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> uh, uh, um. If not dirt, access... <sighs> get all files okay so for each file var world file path bam oh no this is a folder and then in that folder we're getting that the data object retrieve file datas guys sorry i did this code in like july <laughs> so it's been a while retrieve file datas but if you're interested in godot save systems this is basically what i'm doing right now so we have a save file we're opening the file if save file if there if it is there we're making an object and we're getting we're basically turning this into an object that file you guys saw where it was like last updated version blah 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 okay and then we have this world objects and we're appending it to the array and then we're returning that okay save saying retrieve all worlds So we get all if world package world initialize world data. I guess we're telling the thread that we finished doing it. And this return world's finish, it's a signal. Let's see what that signal does. On worlds retrieve success. Um, Shade, uh, you're not perceptive at all. There's literally, it shows what song that's playing right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should be embarrassed. <laughs> uh, for N in world scene box. <laughs> oh, oh changing the story it's okay it's okay <laughs> this is dawdling hey, thank you so much for good the to see you on again log craft today hell yeah let's go woke up and chose buttons <laughs> it's okay if it makes you feel better shade i i do that to everybody <laughs> all right 
Uh, yeah, there is two dottles. So I guess we actually have to like make our save system work. I don't want to do that. Do I even have like a save? I feel like I did make like a save system. Okay, let's do the bare minimum. Look, we have a save and quit. Let's see if that works. I haven't done this in so long. <laughs> Look, he's moonwalking. I don't think it is though, because... No. Okay, let's see what happens when we do save and quit. I would love to see more people using Godot. Okay, but would you say the program is in comparison to engines like Unity? Uh, I used to use Unity and I like this. I think it's very capable. Just Unity and Godot have different design philosophies. And uh, if you like Godot is more of like a, a node system. So it's like you have the individual components of nodes. Uh, of, of In Godot, you have these individual components. So it's like you have sprites, you have rigid body node, you have... Uh, let's look at the nodes. You have a tile map node, tile map node, static body node. You have all these different nodes and you just take the nodes and you build complex structures with the nodes in tree-like structures. And you're able to have these complex objects built from these very fundamental nodes. And these complex objects in Godot are called scenes. I know the naming is kind of weird. People don't really like see, see, like scenes. Um, but yeah, like in Godot, there's the design philosophy isn't to make these ready structures readily available for you to build with. You need to build with them yourself. So it's like, you know, an engine like Unreal, they have all these tools that you can use and you can build your game with already ready-made tools. But that is not, you know, the Godot design philosophy. And that's why it's so lightweight, you know, 53 MB. You click on the app, it opens right away, lightning quick, lightweight. So it's like, if you like, such a engine if that if that sounds good to you then yeah you should use it but it, it, it isn't unity it isn't unreal you know it's yeah it's Godot Honestly, I didn't mind React. The only thing I hated about React was node modules, but React in general wasn't that bad. Unreal, you also make tree structures for your game. However, it have a lot of more functions pre-built like damage per example. You have to make a damage system, but there is a deal damage node already made. It's so weird. Why don't you like event-based programming? I mean...
You could still use like objects, but yeah. What's up, Tomo? Amid everything. <laughs> this is Leonardo. What is the merge layer? Control E. Cool. That was bothering me. Leonardo. Alrighty, so let's see what happens when I save. Leonardo the drawing app is Leonardo We need like a command <laughs> Yes, like the Ninja Turtles exactly all right all right all right all right all right On save world press. Player node equals owner player world. Save all layers. Oh, this is just saving layers. Let's see if that works. I don't think that's I don't think that works anymore for sure. I've added so many layers. Layer data. It's just about saving. I was always a uh, Raphael. My friends and I, when we were younger, we would get like, you know, our broom, like we would take the, the broom head off of the brooms and we would pretend like we were Ninja Turtles and we would beat the shit out of each other. <laughs> Did you guys ever do that? <laughs> I posted a pic of how structure looks like in Unreal. Yeah, this is like inheritance, isn't it? Jackie, were you tomboy? I could see whipping some. <laughs> From the streets of Miami. <laughs> Never riled Jackie up. <laughs> God damn it. Chancleta. So the player is a child and an enemy. And an enemy is a child's one. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's. You could do the same thing here. That's why it's like here in Godot, it's like extends. So if we look at my boar, you see it extends enemy. But that's like something different. So it's like it extends enemy. The enemies all have the same. And then I, it extends entity. But these are like classes I've come up with. So you could you could do that as well. So it's like the entity, all entities, you know, have speed. I'm checking if it's the main character, it has an armor class, it has a health, it has a current status effect, and it has whether it's dead. Yeah, so that's that's just basic inheritance. Um, uh, but yeah, in terms of like the scenes, I need to quit my job. <laughs> yes. In terms of like the scene structure, yeah, there's like multiple layers on it. The scene structure is also a tree. It's a tree in trees. Quit job making. <laughs> okay. Yeah, snow moved to Poland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys, don't tell anyone. Um, my shed is is uh, is gonna be a. Uh, Game dev, um, what's it called? <laughs> I'll take 
I can record. <laughs> As a full stack dev, I'm all I've always really preferred the back end, and so I mostly prefer OOP. React never really jived with my brain. Yeah, I feel like that's why it's like it's not for everybody. That's why these engine wars, like I, I do it for the memes. Um but it's like people prefer different environments and you know it's okay. If someone wants like a more structured, rigid environment where you can't do use Rust. Make a game in Rust. Leave me alone. <laughs> yeah, just do it in Rust. Yeah. Just just leave me alone, okay? <clears throat> Layer data, game state, retrieve all layer data. I said data and then data. <laughs> retrieve all layer data. I don't like, I don't like doing. What does this ancient language? It just make things go boop boop. Oh, I don't like doing save states. I don't think I'm doing it good. No, okay, okay. get I have my game state oh shit this is so outdated it's so outdated that we have like so many layers and honestly, I'm not sure if I should do this because the tile maps are going to be changing so much. And it's not going to be a change in 4.3. But maybe I could just save. Okay. Okay, that's actually a solution. All right. Maybe for now, instead of saving the whole tile state, which is kind of annoying and makes me want to cry. We can just save inventory state because tile state, guys, if you think about it with all these layers. Look, I have. Let me see how many layers I have, like 13 or something. But some of them are like temporary, like the cursor and stuff. It's going to crash. It's going to crash. My game is too big. Good. Does Godot have any kind of native save file system? I think you can do it with like resources, but I'm doing it. I think I'm doing it in JSON. I've heard that there's some vulnerabilities with doing it with the resources, I think. What do I use for di drawing diagrams? It's Leonardo. Okay, we have. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we have a water layer, sand layer. Biome 0 is just the biome floor, the grass. Biome 1 is a little cliff. Biome 2 is a bigger cliff. Biome 3 is the papa cliff. I have floor tiles. So it's like, just like if you have wood in your house. Floor terrain. Because tiles and terrains are different. Terrains kind of like, you know, look prettier. Wall terrains. I like saying that wall terrains. Wall terrains. Um, environment. That's like all the trees and grass and plants and everything. Items. That's like, yeah, when we have specific items like the journal pages and stuff. Temporary. We have temporary and extra temporary. What does that mean? I need to write this down. Temporary and extra temporary. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> what is the extra temporary? Oh, God damn it. Look, did I write notes on it? No, I didn't. Okay, let's look at the extra temporary when I'm using it. Oh, that's when you're, uh, that, that, <coughs> uh, this extra temporary, 
when you're like when you're gonna place a wall and it's like the silhouette of the wall sil ho ete did i spell silhouette right oh my god if i spelled silhouette right then we need a s <gasps> guys i s I didn't even know I could do that. Oh my god. That bro did I did, 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 did I did, did I just hack the system? <laughs> Wait, let me see if it okay, let me see if let me see if I still have it. Did I spell guard right? Wait. Spelled guard right. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Silhouette. Okay. What's up, Black Mage? I, I did hack the system. And I get made fun of because all the boxes and notes in my code. It's good to have that, you know? Okay. Silhouette for placing items and this temporary is cursor because this needs to be updated a lot this is the cursor you see this is the cursor and i don't even think the silhouette works anymore it broke it broke somewhere down the line. And, uh... I kind of want to delete... The last layer, because I don't know what it does. I might have been right anything, because I'm, I'm dumb. What do you do? What do you do? I'm going to delete it. Let me just commit. What did I do? Okay, all right, I'm gonna delete this. Today's spring cleaning, guys. Do you smell spring in the air? I do, because I, I want to clean my code. Okay. The, the, the shitty part is, I wouldn't, I wouldn't know if I broke it. Because, uh... I think I know what happened. Can you delete? Thank you. Smells like corporate cubicle. I'm so sorry, Snoopy. Snoopy's. I just hear chickens screaming. <laughs> okay. Let's see if it's still broken. Okay, that looks good. All right, I think we. I think it's fine now. Bro, can I give chickens ibuprofen? <laughs> I 
I think like they're kind of used to it, you know? Okay, it works. It works. Good. Perfect. What? I'm deleting that. Seven discard. Yeah, it's pretty good weather today. Okay. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to catch up with chat and also like program too. Um, player animation fixed. Okay, so now that we did that, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, I was gonna delete the- wait, I think I already deleted the layer. Reload. I think I need to do that tool to have chunk loading in the editor because this this ain't it. This ain't it. Bro. Okay. I I already re <sighs> You miss about w way less stuff growing up? What do you mean? This is the stuff that when you make a game, what I'm doing right now is the stuff that's not fun when you're making a game. You know, like the save system. That That's, that's, that's. That's the stuff that you're, you know, you, you you start making a game, it's all fun and dandy, you're happy, everyone's happy, and then you get to this stuff, and it's just, it's not fun. It's, it's really not fun. I'm just trying to do everything to see if there's any bugs. Can I even... Oh damn, I can't even make... I need to make it so that you can build walls. Okay, that seems to be working. <sighs> My neon wanna hate you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. All right, I will. I will. Uh, let me read grandpa's journal letter and then we'll we'll do it. What the Why does that wall look like it's in the ground? Okay, that's fine. Does this still work? Yeah. You can unlock. It seems like it's everything is working as intended. Yeah. All right. All right. 
I, I haven't played guitar in a long time, so, so whatever, whatever, whatever. And hey, welcome all the raiders. I hope you're not haters. <laughs> and don't you know she is my favorite girl. I want to run away for days with her. And if you promise not to say a thing, I'm gonna buy that girl a dime. I haven't played the bridge in too long, so I forgot it, but that's it. Hello, Primary Justin. Thank you so much for the raid. <laughs> it's been 280 minutes since you distracted me. <laughs> nah, I haven't. I learned that song probably like 10 years ago. <laughs> See you, <laughs> oh my god you guys all need to get banned first of all all righty aya thank you so much for coming bye how about one more no <laughs> <laughs> how about no game dev song win <gasps> you, you, are you gonna help rocky you can play an instrument are you gonna help you want to contribute okay Come on, Rocky, use that mullet. <laughs> I'm about to bro. Maybe the kazoo. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Can I? I hang out with Jackie for three business days and chat lost their head. <laughs> Alright. I think we're good. I have to look up what the kazoo is, actually. I'm here for the first time to stand up for 25 minutes. It's for my health, okay? About to let loose, you better all chill. Jackie, about to let loose. Let loose. You better all chill. <laughs> I'll check old game music from Project that I never complete. Do it. All right. Oh, that's that's a nice instrument. That's, that's a nice one. <laughs> 
Thank you, Taraco, for telling chat nicely to stay in line. Alrighty, so we're actually just gonna save. Can I actually dump my inventory? I don't know if I'm able to do that. I don't think I can. No, I can't throw it out. Can I like... No, I can't. I think the reason games can get stuck is because you need you know you need to do something and you don't do it because yeah like right now I, I need to do the save system my PC died on me and lost some work oh no damn sorry to hear that Rocky What's up with Unreal losing your work? I'm sorry, but that's, I don't think that's happened to me in Godot. That happened to Snow like this week? That happened to you? That's like an Unreal thing. That's nice, Dottle. Can you explain how to make custom signals with parameters? Oh, it was your, oh, okay. It was your disc. Okay. That sounds un- Because that happened to Snow where her project got corrupted and she lost everything. But I guess that's because you didn't have a- Um, so yeah, Charmy, um... Uh, I just have like a- A global script called Event Bus. Where I keep the signals. So I just call it from this global script. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. Definitely a demons. Alright. Um, okay, so we're gonna save... We are going to save our inventory state, which means we need to load our inventory state. So when this story world loads, I need to find the good point. Save load tile layers. This function runs when you select a world. It sets the node up to play that particular... Wow, thank you, Past Jackie, for actually writing this. Load world data from world name. Call deferred thread group. Load all layer data. Match. Okay, yeah, so if it's story, which is the only thing. We have this immutable tile object. Oh, so this is getting the base world, which is the same for everybody. That's actually a smart way of doing it. <laughs> Past Jackie was cool, yeah. How's your projects going, Justin? I need to keep up with your... Last I checked, you were doing like a rock, paper, scissors? So yeah, I, I separated the world to like immutable tiles. So basically like the sand, the sand and the grass are not going to change for anybody. You know, it, it persists through like any save file. And then the rest, I guess, can change. Actually, maybe because I want to have mining... But I don't think I want you to mine these mountains. That would be kind of weird if you could mine the mountains. Let 
but I'm rebuilding building my video tools along the way. So it'll be a while. That's awesome. I can't wait to see your first, to see your Godot, like your, your videos with that whole structure in Godot. That would be so awesome. Do others use the version control add-on? I, I don't. I use GitHub. Sadly not yet. I have a bit of a red tape to figure out. Plus my games still don't have a name. Yeah, Rocky, this is not going to be called Lawcraft. <laughs> I have like a name that I want to use for this game, but the problem is there's a movie that's named after it, and I think I could get into some trouble for that. I And I try to limit the amount of add-ons I use for my game, because I like to use the latest versions. <laughs> you can use Lawcraft, yes. Okay, okay. Um, Damn, this jet lag is really bad. Like, I keep forgetting what I'm doing. <laughs> is it all going to be on the surface map or are you going to have interiors? Yeah, we do have interiors. It's Mary Poppins. <laughs> I like that name, Donald. Yeah, Manjenko. I actually really like that movie, The Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> I know, it's really bad. It's really bad. My jet lag is... Okay, so I was doing the save system. So actually, let me just screenshot my... I think I'm gonna do a new Leonardo scene. I wanna get rid of these grid lines. I don't know how to do that. You see, like, one task, the other. Um, I think. View. Oh, show grid there. Okay, I don't need a new. Bam. Yeah, GDC was awesome. I really recommend it. You know, I did something. Oh, the music stopped. One second. I don't hear anything. Do you guys? I think the stream is still going on, but there's no music. I don't know what happened. That's weird. Is it all sound? Yeah. Um, so yeah, uh, Justin, I think it's a uh, it's an awesome place like to meet people to just get inspired with game development. Okay, let me see. Could be this.
This is using my webcam mic. <laughs> this probably sounds like the worst thing in the world. I don't know what happened to my mic.
Mission failed. We'll get them next time.